Okay. Indiana Jones and the Kingdom of the Crystal Skull. So this is the Indiana Jones movie that I like the least. I've also seen it the least. But I actually, the beginning part is my favorite of the whole movie. And it's because, well, you get to see Indy fight a bunch of, I almost said Nazis, fight a bunch of uh, Russians in their little lab. And then you get to watch him get nuked. I mean, tell me that doesn't sound awesome. And he survives in a refrigerator. Like, really? I remember watching that when I was younger. And even I thought that made no sense. Anyways, it, I mean, it was still a cool scene. Like, I'm not complaining. But, like, it just doesn't make any sense. Um, But, like, after that, I mean, Mutt is pretty cool. The scenes with Mutt, the motorcycle chase is pretty cool. But, like, I don't know. There's, like, there's a lot of this movie that's just kind of, like, bad. The ants are cool when the ants are eating people. But, like, like there's really not that the movie's not horrendous. It's not amazing. Like, I, if you've never seen it, go watch it. I wouldn't say watch it multiple times or anything like that. Uh, the ending, though, like, the in, it just doesn't make any sense. All the crystal skulls form into one. They bring aliens back to life. And the aliens kill the lady with knowledge. And then they just fly away and everything floods. Like, really? We couldn't have come up with a better ending than that. But, um, yeah, I mean, it's not a bad movie, but it's definitely not my favorite movie. Oh, that's pretty much it.